everyone. Right, I've just started doing, let me just shift that out of the way. Um, I've just started doing my um, stamps and <laughs> quite like it. Fabulous because I can be straight away, I know. I mean, they're not very thingy, I've got ink all over them, so I'm going to redo these uh, papers. Um, but yeah, I'm just getting them ready and sorting them out, and then I'll go through them and do them nice and neat. Um, I'm absolutely thrilled with them. So, um, CD covers, 50 in a pack, £1.49 or something, £1.39, something like that. And um, I'm going to be able to cover all my stamps, um, protect them, know exactly where they are, and pop them into my box, which I'm going to do in a minute. Like that. There you go. And they're there inside my box. Like that. And all I need to do is then flick through them and I know what I've got. So I'm absolutely thrilled with that. And all I did was I cut a piece of acetate which was the same size as the um yeah, as the sleeve. Um plus did the paper as well. So I'm just gonna show you couple of bits. Let's find another stamp to do. And um, I've got this bird cage one. This is the bird house thing. So I'm just gonna stamp over it because I'm not putting these on a block. Some I can put on a block and some I can't. Well I'm not gonna. <laughs> so it's just a stamp over that. I only need a rough guess to see what's on it. I'm not fussed at all. Pop that onto my square. Sorry if you can't see that. This is what I'm doing pop that onto my square, press it down, I know exactly what I've got, slot that into the back, uh, sorry into the front of the sleeve, oh, that was too big sorry, I thought I cut them down the right size, all of these, nip that off no problem, slot it in, Clean the stamp, just let me get a tissue. Take hold of my cloth and dry it off. Nice clean stamp. Pop that onto the acetate, that's all I'm doing like that. And then I sit that in front. like that and then all I've been doing bit of tape fold the flap over pop it down I know exactly what I've got in my sleeve not bad made up with that absolutely thrilled they're not all clumped together I mean at the moment I've just got these resting in this box because I've nowhere to put them but I won't need that now will I I'll be able to do them all properly so just that I'll show you that and uh, yeah I'm quite made up with it um, don't know if I finished showing this last night I can't remember actually with everything on it but Aggie this is yours as well and hold it up look oh, that's your tag as well well it's a plaque you can pop a picture in here anyway I'm going to be doing some more things, so I'll speak to you soon. Tatty bye. Oh, wait a minute, I've just remembered. Sorry. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Right. For your gilding flakes, you need some gilding paste. So if you're looking, Aggie, if you're watching, um, to put the gilding flake, unless you're doing it on this, which is the double sided tape. But you can use that for delicate areas and it gets right in. You just dab it on with your brush. So I just thought I'll let you know. Um, PBO, that's uh, gilding paste. And I am going to be showing you how to use the uh, art masking fluid shortly. So I'll speak to you soon. Bye.